you think? Good. Good morning, everybody. It's Tuesday morning, August 21st, 2018, and we're headed into work and school for the day. Uh, this is going to be Grant's first day at uh, Before Care. Oh, it looks like Miss Michelle, doesn't it? It is. Is it? Yes. It is? Yes. Yeah. Huh. Cool. That must be her kid, one of her kids or something. Um, Grant is going to be in his first day of before care and after care. So he's going to go both today, right? Before and after care. And yesterday he rode the bus home on accident and went to his mom's house instead of going to after care. Um, today, hopefully it's going to be a good day. His he said his teacher told him to go into the bus. And I told her that I need to go by my dad and I needed this dumb sign. She said you needed something? I needed a sign. A sign to go like there? A piece of paper written. Okay. But All right, we're I gonna... don't have one though. Okay, I did write a note today. And I put it in your folder that says that you're going to aftercare today. Okay. Um, so that's it. We are uh, going to have a good day today. It rained last night. We got the grass cut barely. Uh, it was pouring rain by the time we were done, wasn't it? We were running. It was, yeah, it was good though. We got soaked, but that's okay. We got the grass cut. We were safe. Did it safely, so I want to have a good. It's also pouring by um, lake too. Yeah, at the lake. Yep. I want you to have a good day today. Hopefully, it didn't flood up to the thing that you walk on the bridge. Yeah. That ha it happened last year. Remember? You talking about like the dam bridge, the big bridge? Yeah, the one that you start on, when, like you go. Yeah. Yep. All right, I want you to have a good day today. I love you, bud. Hey, what's up, everybody? It's getting out of work for lunch for the day. Uh, I went to go get uh, look into what it would cost to have my windows tinted on this new car. Uh, all the windows but the front windshield would be 300 bucks. So I actually don't think that's bad of a deal to use 3M uh, tint or, or vinyl or whatever it's called. Um, I think that, uh, well, I know like there's places that I'll do it for like 100 bucks. But that's like the shit that turns like purple or whatever and then bubbles and crinkles and stuff. So the 3M has like a lifetime warranty against bubbles and discolorization or discoloring and stuff. Um, I don't know if I necessarily have money for that right now. Uh, I do have to pay off some bills and stuff. So I'll be working on that. Um, so I ended up going to Meyer and picked up some drop cloths. So we did some work uh, above the ceiling running some cables at that client site last week and got like dust and all that shit all over everyone's desks and they complained about it. So I tried to clean it up as best as I could but um, what I did was I just went out and got some drop cloths that I can put over their desks and all that and then hopefully not have to deal with any of that noise. So I'm excited about that. Uh, they were four bucks for three of them or something. And then uh, I still got, I, I did sell one of my, uh, I sold one of my graphics cards for my mining rig today. It finished, it was a week long auction. Sold for 237 bucks, which is like half of what I paid. But considering how much money they made them over the years, uh, not too bad. Looks like my buddy Luke just kicked me off of his Amazon Prime. So I'm not sure what's up with that. Um, no reply back from the no reply back from the teacher asking her why she sent Grant home on the bus yesterday. Um, There's all kinds of stuff going on, so. Uh, trying to think what else is up. Not much. So I'm just uh, getting back to work now. And I spent the morning shredding more paper. And I'm going to probably do a little bit more today. Tomorrow, 1230, I have a massage appointment. Thursday, Grant has baseball practice after work, and just a lot of shit going on, man, so 
Yeah, stay tuned for more. Hey, hey guys, just getting out of work for the day and we're looking at the end of an era. So I sold today, the auction finally ended, it was a week long auction. I sold my first graphics card. So the one that I sold is a uh, 1070 GTX FTW non-hybrid card. I sold it for 240 bucks or so. I don't think the person has paid me yet. So I need to uh, wait until I get payment. So I'm guessing I can probably sell my two hybrid cards for about 300 each. Uh, my non-hybrid cards for probably like somewhere around where I just sold it for about 220, 240. So I have three non-hybrids, two hybrids. So we're looking at uh, probably around 1200 bucks. I uh, still will have my mining rig, so I'm not sure what I'm gonna do with that. So I might end up buying um, maybe one good gaming card, or maybe I'll just keep one of the cards for my gaming rig. We'll see. But uh, yeah, so it's gonna be, uh, that'll be it then for crypto guys. I mean, I still, I think I'm still holding my Masternode coins, it's only worth like a couple hundred bucks. So it's uh, kind of bittersweet. I've been doing this for I think like two years, maybe longer. I think I started all this when I was vlogging. So I've, I've been vlogging longer than the crypto, I think. But, uh, you know, crypto has paid a lot of bills. It's dug me out of a bunch of holes. And it also has uh, afforded me some nice things that uh, I typically would not have been able to have. So that's kind of nice. So I just... Uh, I just had to go to my storage locker and dig out the empty boxes for my graphics cards. Um, you know, I save all that stuff because it's, it's worth money. So the, I bought it with the intention of selling it off one day or whatever. So um, it's hard to say if I got my money's worth. Uh, I think this mining rig is only like a year old. And I'm selling the cards for probably... Um, The non-hybrid card I just sold for probably about half of what I bought it at. So, not not so good, but uh, I think the hybrid cards will be about maybe 30% less. So I, I think I, I made money off of it. Um, well, I, I, I'll, I did make money. You know, the, the deal with mining is you got an, a big upfront initial cost of buying all the hardware. And, uh, but then you recoup some of that when you sell or upgrade or whatever. So, um, you know, like that mining rig might've cost me 2,500 bucks or something and I'll get half of it back, but I've made, um, money in the, in the meantime. So right now I'm only mining the, the my mining rewards are only worth like 80 bucks or a hundred bucks. That's what I'm selling.